in mathematics, particularly in linear algebra, tensor analysis, and differential geometry, the Levi Civita symbol represents a collection of numbers. Defined from the sign of a permutation of the natural numbers 1, 2, a euro, n, for some positive integer n. It is named after the Italian mathematician and physicist Tullio Levi Civita. Other names include the permutation symbol, antisymmetric symbol, or alternating symbol, which refer to its antisymmetric property and definition in terms of permutations. The standard letters to denote the Levi Civita symbol are the Greek lowercase epsilon i micron or i micron, or less commonly the Latin lowercase e. Index notation allows one to display permutations in a way compatible with tensor analysis. Where each index i1, i2, a euro, in takes values 1, 2, a euro, n. There are n n indexed values of, which can be arranged into an n dimensional array. The key definitive property of the symbol is total antisymmetry in all the indices. When any two indices are interchanged, equal or not, the symbol is negated. If any two indices are equal, the symbol is zero. When all indices are unequal, we have where p is the number of interchanges of indices necessary to unscramble i1, i2, a euro, in into the order 1, 2, a euro, n, and the fact orp is called the sign or signature of the permutation. The value i micron 12 a euro n must be defined, else the particular values of the symbol for all permutations are indeterminate. Most authors choose i micron 12 a euro n equals plus 1, which means the Levi Civita symbol equals the sign of a permutation when the indices are all unequal. This choice is used throughout this article. The term n dimensional Levi Civita symbol refers to the fact that the number of indices on the symbol n matches the dimensionality of the relevant vector space in question, which may be Euclidean or non Euclidean, pure space or space time. The values of the Levi Civita symbol are independent of any metric tensor and coordinate system. Also, the specific term symbol emphasizes that it is not a tensor because of how it transforms between coordinate systems, however it can be interpreted as a tensor density. The Levi Civita symbol allows the determinant of a square matrix, and the cross product of two vectors in 3D Euclidean space, to be expressed in index notation. Definition The common dimensionalities of the Levi Civita symbol are in 3D and 4D, and to some extent 2D so it is useful to see these definitions before the general one in any number of dimensions. Equals two dimensions equals, the two-dimensional Levi Civita symbol is defined by. The values can be arranged into a two-a, two-antisymmetric matrix. Use of the 2D symbol is relatively uncommon, although in certain specialized topics like supersymmetry and twister theory it appears in the context of two spinners. The 3D and higher dimensional Levi Civita symbols are used more commonly. Equals three dimensions equals. In three dimensions, the Levi Civita symbol is defined as follows. That is. Is one if is an even permutation of, a one if it is an odd permutation, and zero if any index is repeated. In three dimensions only, the cyclic permutations of are all even permutations. Similarly the anticyclic permutations are all odd permutations. This means in 3D it is sufficient to take cyclic or anticyclic permutations of and easily obtain all the even or odd permutations. Analogous to 2D matrices, the values of the 3D Levi Civita symbol can be arranged into a 3A, 3A, 3 array. Where I is the depth, J the row and K the column. Some examples equals four dimensions equals, in four dimensions, the Levi Civita symbol is defined as. These values can be arranged into a 4A, 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 4 array, although in 4D and high this is difficult to draw. Some examples equals generalization to n dimensions equals, the Levi Civita symbol can be generalized to n dimensions. Thus, it is the sign of a permutation in the case of a permutation, and zero otherwise. Using the capital Pi notation for ordinary multiplication of numbers, an explicit expression for the symbol is. Where the product is totally antisymmetric in all indices, 
and the sine function extracts the sine of each difference discarding the absolute value. The formula is true for all index values, and for any n. However, it is seldom used in practice since interchanging indices is quicker. Properties a tensor whose components in an orthonormal basis are given by the Levi Civita symbol is sometimes called a permutation tensor. It is actually a pseudo tensor because under an orthogonal transformation of Jacobian determinant of 1, it acquires a minus sign. As the Levi Civita symbol is a pseudo tensor, the result of taking a cross product is a pseudo vector, not a vector. Under a general coordinate change, the components of the permutation tensor are multiplied by the Jacobian of the transformation matrix. This implies that in coordinate frames different from the one in which the tensor was defined, its components can differ from those of the Levi Civita symbol by an overall factor. If the frame is orthonormal, the factor will be a plus or minus 1 depending on whether the orientation of the frame is the same or not. In index 3 tensor notation, the Levi Civita symbol is replaced by the concept of the Hodge dual. In a context where tensor index notation is used to manipulate tensor components, the Levi Civita symbol may be written with its indices as either subscripts or superscripts with no change in meaning, as might be convenient. Thus, one could write. In these examples, superscripts should be considered equivalent with subscripts. Summation symbols can be eliminated by using Einstein notation, where an index repeated between two or more terms indicates summation over that index. For example, in the following examples, Einstein notation is used. Equals two dimensions equals, in two dimensions, when all i, j, m, n each take the values 1 and 2. Equals three dimensions equals, index and symbol values, in three dimensions, when all i, j, k, m, n each take values 1, 2, and 3. Product, the Levi Civita symbol is related to the Kronecker delta. In three dimensions, the relationship is given by the following equations. A special case of this result is sometimes called the contracted epsilon identity. In Einstein notation, the duplication of the i index implies the sum on i. The previous is then denoted. Equals n dimensions equals, index and symbol values, in n dimensions, when all i1. In, j1. jn take values 1, 2. n. Where the exclamation mark denotes the factorial, and i i plus or minus a euro, i squared a euro is the generalized Kronecker delta. For any n, the property follows from the facts that, Every permutation is either even or odd, plus 1, 2 equals 2 equals 1, and, the number of permutations of any n element set number is exactly n. Product, in general, for n dimensions, one can write the product of two Levi Civita symbols as equals proofs equals, 4, both sides are antisymmetric with respect to vision mn. We therefore only need to consider the case i a perm l j and m a perm l n. By substitution, we see that the equation holds for, that is, for i equals m equals 1 and j equals n equals 2 since the equation is antisymmetric in Ishan mn, any set of values for these can be reduced to the above case. The equation thus holds for all values of Ishan mn. Using, we have 4. Here we use the Einstein summation convention with i going from 1 to 2. Next, follows similarly from. To establish, Notice that both sides vanish when i a perm l j. Indeed, if i a perm l j, then one cannot choose m and n such that both permutation symbols on the left are non-zero. Then, with i equals j fixed, there are only two ways to choose m and n from the remaining two indices. For any such indices, we have no summation, and the result follows. Then follows since 3 equals 6 and for any distinct indices i, j, k taking values 1, 2, 3, we have applications and examples equals determinants equals, in linear algebra, the determinant of a 3 a, 3 square matrix A equals can be written. Similarly the determinant of an n A, n matrix A equals can be written as, where each A should be summed over 1. 
n, or equivalently. Where now each and each j are should be summed over 1, n. More generally, we have the identity. Equals vector cross product equals. Cross product, if a equals and b equals a vector is in, their cross product can be written as a determinant. Hence also using the Levi Civita symbol, and more simply. In Einstein notation, the summation symbols may be omitted, and the ith component of their cross product equals. The first component is. Then by cyclic permutations of 1, 2, 3 the others can be derived immediately, without explicitly calculating them from the above formulae. Triple scalar product, from the above expression for the cross product, we have. If c equals is another vector, then the triple scalar product equals. From this expression, it can be seen that the triple scalar product is antisymmetric when exchanging any pair of arguments. For example, curl, if f equals is a vector field defined on some open set of as a function of position x equals, then the ith component of the curl of f equals, which follows from the cross product expression above, substituting components of the gradient vector operator. Tensor density, in any arbitrary curve a linear coordinate system and even in the absence of a metric on the manifold, the Levi Civita symbol as defined above may be considered to be a tensor density field in two different ways. It may be regarded as a contravariant tensor density of weight plus 1 or as a covariant tensor density of weight a 1. In n dimensions using the generalized Kronecker delta. Notice that these are numerically identical. In particular, the sign is the same. Levi Civita tensors, on a pseudo Riemannian manifold, one may define coordinate invariant covariant and contravariant tensor fields whose coordinate representations agree with the Levi Civita symbol wherever the coordinate system is such that the basis of the tangent space is orthonormal with respect to the metric and matches a selected orientation. These tensors should not be confused with each other nor should they be confused with the tensor density fields mentioned above. The covariant Levi Civita tensor in a given coordinate system is. Where is the representation of the metric in that coordinate system? This tensor may be converted to the contravariant tensor by raising the indices with the metric as usual, but a minus sign is needed if the metric signature contains an odd number of negatives. Where S is the number of negatives in the signature? This results in the following. Equals example, Minkowski space equals, in Minkowski space, the covariant Levi Civita tensor is. But the contravariant Levi Civita tensor is. Notice the minus sign. The following are identities. See also, symmetric tensor, antisymmetric tensor, Kronecker delta, list of permutation topics. Notes. References. J. A. Wheeler, C. Misner, K. S. Thorne. Gravitation. W. H. Freeman and Company pages 85 a Euro 86, A section 3.5. ISBN 0 7167 0344 0. D. E. Nerenschwander. Tensor Calculus for Physics. Johns Hopkins University Press pages 11, 29, 95. ISBN 978-1-4214-1565-9. External links. This article incorporates material from Levi Civita permutation symbol on Planet Math, which is licensed under the Creative Commons Attribution Share Alike license. Permutation Tensor, MathWorld Wolfram.